All right, guys. So today's Friday. It is the last For day sure. of June. God bless America, baby. Fourth of July next week. Freedom Week, baby. Just a couple of things that I wanted to talk about before we start listening today is the opportunity of having a new day. I think it's ever so often that as people, specifically men in today's age, we get caught lacking. We get caught in the lull of everyday activity and monotonous activity, right? And I was just thinking, you know, I was just brainstorming, like soul searching. What can we do as young men, as figures in our society, figures in our community, to spread awareness in what way could you teach other individuals how to find that fire within, you know? Everybody has that capability of kicking it into high gear, but it's just a lot of people really just don't know how. They don't know how deep their own reservoirs go. They don't know how to just shift gears in a stressful situation, you know? But I think that might be something that we're gonna be talking about today, you know, throughout the bench, or maybe even at the end of the video, you know? But I know for me, something to hold myself accountable is I wanna be giving every single set, every single rep, 110% effort. That's one thing. So take lessons, you know? Try to find a weakness and that you can continue to improve Focus on that, get a goal list, and attack it. But anyways, I was literally telling Carlos the exact same thing. See? No, Carlos. See? I, and I didn't even tell him nothing about what I He didn't him. tell me nothing, Carlos. It's, we got some bench today. We're going to work out and then have a good bodybuilding accessory after. As you can see, me and Paulo are matching. Did he touch you, bro? Did he touch you? Did he, did he touch me? Yeah. Yeah. Who touched you, bro? <laughs> Everyone. Everyone. Everyone's like, yeah. We got three reps in the bar. This is gonna be like my first real working set. Just because ever since Worlds, my bench has been feeling like absolute dog duty. So, you know, it's just one of those things where you take what you have on the day and you build up little by little, right? So, let's see how this moves. If this moves good, I would like to hit maybe like 200 for five. If I can hit 200 for five today at pretty smooth, then I know I'm gonna, it's like autocorrect, you know what I'm saying? Of course, sponsored by Airwave. Don't forget to get y'all's mouthpieces. And this is just to show that we actually use our mouthpieces. Everybody that we sponsor with, it's because we love our products and we actually use them. That's nice. That's really nice. Honestly, guys, it's really easy to be bored with just simply benching and accessories. Especially when you've been doing this for so many times, like the monotony can get drag, draggy. Um, but that's where you do your due diligence and you bypass that and passion is what drives you through every single session, right? So that's literally all we're here for. This is why we've been doing this for so long. It's just, we're some passionate sons of guns. So Pablo's looking great today. This guy just smoked 375 for two, looking locked in. like. I've been training with Pablo long enough to know like when bench is clicking and based off that double warm up, he's, he's dialed in baby. So now I gotta do my job and respect his effort by matching the intensity. And like I said at the beginning of the video, 110% baby. That's literally what we're giving. I'm uh, content with how that moved and felt compared to Tuesday and last Friday. We're making progress, baby. One, two, three. Oh, yeah. Oh, 
was nice. I think it's the bar. One, two, three, good, go! That was way better. All right guys, so as you guys saw, we switched the bars for this top set. And the bar that we were using, the other one, the Kabuki, the sleeve needs to be oiled up because you want it, you want those plates to be able to roll naturally, right? And whenever the bar is kind of stiff and rusty, it tends to get stiff, where maybe one side has some sort of rotation and it kind of counteracts and it just throws it off in your hand. Oh, I thought you were leaving. Are you gonna drop this video? Maybe like next year? No. Nah, <laughs> you better drop you better drop that. You guys. Spam at official.polo PO number one zero and tell him to drop the corrupted strike video. ASAP. Anyways guys I woke up with a renewed heart this morning. God is good. Uh, if you want a relationship with Jesus, it starts with fearing God first. That's the only way. So if you feel like you can do whatever you want in this world, it's not how it works. Vlogging, bro. Don't judge me when I'm vlogging. You need the gloves first. All right, guys. So we're here at Nardas. Just gonna do a quick vlog session. You know, try to give you guys some more content outside of the gym. Um, not got much to say today, so we're gonna keep it short. I'm here with the whole family, well, except mom and the kids to sit at home. Um, but. We're just gonna have some fun today and shoot some guns. So hopefully we make our shots and we're gonna be out there practicing safe gun habits. We love you guys. Oh yeah. We'll show you outside. Viewers discretion advised. If you don't like guns, go ahead and click out of this video. Shot. <laughs> Where the hell's your protection, bro? You can't go in raw dogging. 